so how is my degree in mechanical engineering gonna help us in our startup i already did a video about this but i only talked about i think three subjects of this semester and today i'm gonna talk about the other three starting off with uh, maths um, i have a subject that's just maths and basically basically what we do is derivatives and integrals just that and so i find it very boring i don't i don't see a future where i'm gonna use that in a in a regular job uh, as an engineering but my teacher uh, said something about telecommunication companies that have buildings they have like three floors or even an entire building uh, just with just with computers, um, it, this, these buildings are called data centers. And basically what the computers do there, it's just these math trans transformations to process science. I don't know what this means, but it told me that this is crucial for these companies. And that's why we don't see a lot of telecommunication companies, different ones, uh, in just one country. I mean, I'm in Portugal and I think we have like five um, and that's because you need a very good amount of money to invest in, in this field because if, as we're talking about, you, you need a, a an entire building full of computers and servers, it, you can't imagine how much you need to spend to build a company like that. Personally, I don't like these derivatives and integrals uh, studies but that's just my personal opinion of course that I say this is a boring subject for me but you might like it I don't know it's really subjective but I think this one subject in particular is not gonna help us so much um, in the development of our company uh, unless that we need some of this knowledge to some software thing I don't know uh, I think I think we already use some of these when we develop our file format but I'm not the right person to talk about this you know I know what we are doing but I don't know how to explain it in software terms next one we got metal materials and this one was surprisingly uh, inter interesting for me uh, because I didn't know I like so much uh, to find out things about materials like the fusion point or you know the treatments that you need to do to uh, work on a certain with a certain material to build a mechanical piece or whatever you want to build uh, that's something that I, I've never searched about and when I start to learn about it I, I got really excited and I had a kind of a business idea which is really basic. Uh, I didn't really think about it yet uh, because you know I, I'm I'm with Duckflare and that's all I do for now. But who knows in the future I can just build a a piece manufacturing factory. You know uh, I don't know. It's it was an idea because there is not so so many people with this with this knowledge. I mean in this field and there's neither so many people capable of and with the will to to build something from the from zero to build a company from from the bottom and so my final thoughts about this subject is uh, that this might this one might be useful but not for now not for Duckler. and finally we got technical drone and this one is very very useful for us and i would say it is even crucial because this is all about what we're going to reproduce uh, in our software. What I do in the classes is exactly, almost exactly what we're going to recreate in our company product. And personally, I really like this subject because it, it is a really different one. Uh, it's nothing to do with the, all the other ones that I, that I had until now uh, because it's just a practical uh, subject we just have some I don't it's like uh, one hour per week that is it is um, theoretical stuff about this about uh, about drawing but then we just practice it we just start to draw in a very in kind of a big shit uh, 
Uh, I can show it right here. Okay, all right, this is a... This is a uh, this is an exercise. This is what we we got on our exams. Just one exercise. Our exam exams should be should have like three of these. I don't know. Then we just in this one particularly, we just see these. You know, it's all separated in pieces, and then the goal is to imagine how it would be when it, it, it is all together and draw it. And then uh, we got an exercise that that's exactly the opposite. And we also got some exercise that it just, uh, it is just going to the book, this book right here, this book right here, and uh, just search for some information and complete the exercise. And this is the part of this subject that I don't like due to the fact that I love this because there's nothing to do with numbers and writing stuff or do some math, you know, it's just drawing. I, I think that's the whole why I like this subject. And this part has a little bit of numbers, you need to do some calculations about the margins you get when you build something with a certain precision, you know. Um, it's very technical, but in general, this is a really good subject and it's going to be crucial for us. So I said that this is almost exactly what we're going to recreate because our goal is to make a canvas editor where you just don't have to work with paper and, and a pen. And in the future, it will have some into, uh, artificial intelligence uh, and will do things all the hard things for you the corrections uh, when you don't have when you don't want to have to spend uh, like two hours or three just analyzing and correcting all the all the wrong stuff on a drawing of course that it's it needs to be a a digital drawing but we, we're working on that part too to just automatically transcribe to the manual drawing to the digital drawing but then as we we are going to be working to companies that do construction uh, hvac etc there is some themes and some fields that we need to be really precise and we need to pay attention to some details that we can only learn um, if we had this knowledge that this subject gives me. So that's it. With the other video, I think I just wrapped up my entire semester. Here it is how my degree is gonna help us on building our company.